Good morning, lovelies. I hope you have a wonderful Tuesday. Okay, I don't think Shakespeare could have coined this reading any better. Okay, I think you're going to have to um, pay attention today. Don't put rose-colored glasses on with something. I think what's happening here is I think that this is either something that started in November or dropped off in November. Something happened a bit ago. I don't think this is going to be something brand new out of the gate. I think this may be a continuation of something or something loops back around or um, something to that regard. Okay, we come in with the Page of Wands. We've got the Knight of Coins and the King of Coins. And we've got the Lover card. Okay. We have no cups <laughs> and we have no swords. So it, it, it may be a little chilly, right? When we don't have cups, we're not receptive. Um, which I think may be working to your advantage, maybe. Um, when we're out of balance, I should say, let me rephrase that. When we're out of balance, it's never a good thing. But we also don't have any swords here, so there's no logical thinking. Don't get caught up in something that appears to be too good to be true. If something were, this would be a perfect example of what a twin flame relationship would look like, okay? I think that it would pack quite a while up here. I think that um, love affairs, relationships, maybe someone that you met, maybe something went on in your current relationship. This could be on the job front too. Coins have to do with the passage of time also, okay? Um, I think you're really being advised to really pay attention. Don't overlook something that's sitting right in front of you. Trust your intuition. If it's screaming to you that there's a missing link here, which I'm I'm pretty sure that there is, I would bet the ranch that something is not quite as it appears to be here. I think it may be quite startling when the pieces come together. Okay. Um, I just don't think that you're privy to all that is real here. I think there's missing pieces here. Um, I do think, though, honestly, that you're going to see something here that you either mistook about someone, someone said something that wasn't really true. There's missing pieces here, okay? And I think that uh, the results may be startling here, too. These may be uh, paperwork. They could be also documentation. You may have signed off on something that's not quite what it appears to be, and like now you get your first, you know, invoice in the mail, and it's three times what it should have been. I think for the majority of you, though, this is this is a relationship kind of deal. I think something may have gone on over, you know, November. This could be something too that if it's if it's not happened. It's it's definitely something that you're not surprised by. Like, this isn't a new person that walks into your life. This is, I think, really someone that has been in this, the, the midst for a bit, and I think that whatever it is is coming back around. Um, this is not the time, guys. I really wish I could say that twin frame relationships are, are all that you really think that they are, but, but unfortunately they're not. They pack a wall up like this, right? They're here, though to teach you massive lessons, but you really want to wake up here and pay attention because if Rico Suave is standing right in front of you and he or she is telling you that, you know, life is but a dream, it, it kind of is because there's missing pieces through this story. Okay, so um, This is either the wrong person for you or it's the wrong time. It's one of the two. Um, again, I hate to burst your bubble, but there's something sitting here that just isn't quite what it is. Um,
this could be also um, I really think it has to do with that. I really can't go even any further than that. I think that something was overlooked. You may have met someone or come across something or you could have done something financially too. It could be also um, maybe something uh, medical or health related turns out to be not what it appeared to be or uh, you get test results back and they're not at all what you thought it would be or there's a big miss uh, there could be something like that too there could be a big mismatch I'm not a doctor so do not quote me on this but there could be a mismatch in either a test or, or a diagnosis that you had opposed to something that comes across now it, it, it'll be completely different or it, it just really I think you're just shocked a little bit in whatever this is so let me know what it is I you know, it, it, we're, we're missing elements, so I can't say that this would be something that was welcomed. I can't, because we're missing two key elements in here. Okay, so um, that's what I've got to go at. All right, so there you go. If you need a private reading, please reach out to me. I don't think this is going to be minus the health spectrum. That might be a little bit shocking but again not a doctor but on the other end of this I don't think if this is a relationship or uh, I think someone may have you know been a little exaggerated in maybe something that they told you and it wasn't quite exactly how it is like there's a big chunk missing here you know something like that so um, there you go. If you need a private reading, please reach out to me. I don't think this is bad. I think what this is going to do is give you clarity on something so that you can get past it. This is not a time where you want to be circling the airport. So if you were waiting on someone, the example would be if, if someone told you, you know, they're divorced or something, you may find out now that that they're not. It may be something like that. Either way, I think you'll be quite shocked but I don't think you'll be surprised in hindsight, right? But that doesn't help you in the moment. So there you go. I hope I helped you in some way. If you need a private reading, please reach out to me. I'll be more than happy to help you with anything, okay? Don't camp out on signs either, okay? I know we've got coin elements here and we've got fire elements here. But at the core, you know, kings are fire and um, pages are air, earth, um, so don't camp out on signs, okay? This is something that's in the making, so, you know, it may not even apply to you, so there you go, okay? Thank you so much.